Taking Myla for a walk after work, November, September. Damn, days just blend together. <laughs> Do we need to put numbers on them? Day six. Day six? Yeah, day six. Work was busy today. I had to have some serious meetings that I've been preparing for for a week and a half. But they went very well. So, yeah. They went very well. Now, this morning we played some online poker. Probably we had four tables going for about half an hour. So what's that? 150 hands maybe. We'll check when we get back. I think I had one or two hands to go over, so. All right, looks like we only played about 87 hands. One about a buy-in, because we're still buying in for 25. Uh, it looks like there's two hands where I made a decent amount of money. Let's see if I can load them up. All right, so I'm running short on time. I don't know why I can't get this to hide. I'll, I'll figure it out for in the future. We have ace queen, uh, he must have posted, and then I just squeeze here. 175, we get the big blind call, seven deuce calls. Flop a queen, I check, it's three handed, he bets, I just call, and then this guy calls behind, so that's a little scary for me. Gotta play pretty slow now. So I check, he checks again, and he bets small. I just call, worried what this guy's gonna do. Figure he's gonna raise if he has a jack at this point to try to get me all in. Uh, nine bucks in the middle and only betting a buck, so. River brings an eight. I check again. He checks. The guy goes all in for 342. Sure, this is a jack a lot, but the price I'm getting, I just call. And this guy over calls, and we're good here. This guy had king queen, I remember. And then we have this. Other hand, maybe this will get rid of it. Won't sh I won't, but we have king nine off on the button. We raise small blind calls. Uh, C bet this flop. It's not a flop. We really should be C betting a lot with this hand, but we do because it, at this level it works. We we bank our king, and then this guy starts leading. So all we can really do at this point is call down. Um. There's no draws. He's kind of representing that he's king 10, king 6, king 5, which I don't think he had a ton of, but he could have because he's 50% V-pip. He bets big on the river, 10 bucks. Uh, he leaves 338 behind. I don't know. Like I just To me, this line is just really weird, so I paid him off, and we were good. So those are the two big hands. Hopefully I'll figure out uh, a way to post these easier and quicker so you guys don't see the results uh, by, by the time it happens. So. so so that was one of that day. Um, I didn't do too much outside my norm. Had that busy day at work, like I said. We went for a walk. We saw that crazy ass, massive slug that you saw some video of. And then we just played some WoW and we are working i'm working on my uh first video content video for wow um, it's going to be an introduction for noobs uh introduction for noobs specifically hunters and yeah i did some work on that but overall i was pretty tired like it's midweek i wake up at 5 30 a.m every day uh get some online and get some video in and then i i'm in bed by 9 30 10 o'clock every day so during the week I'm lucky if I get to the poker room once. Um, mostly I'm playing online and I'm doing most of those sessions at 5.30 in the morning. And I'm also, I have that little doggy that I have to take care of. So other than that, we're getting ready to tomorrow's Thursday night football. Probably having no action. That game looks insane uh, to be betting on Tennessee at Jacksonville. And yeah, I'm going to be putting up a video going over some of the spreads of week three. I'm going to figure out my survivor pool pick. Uh, so Thursday, it's going to be a little more action for this. Uh, but Wednesday, hump day. 
not much going on, but I need to stick with my plan and just diarize what I'm doing and how things are going. So day six in the books. We'll see you all again tomorrow. Hell yeah.